Number 29, if x and y are real numbers, so okay, they're not imaginary, which of the following cannot be inferred from the statement above? In order for x squared to be equal to y squared, it is sufficient that x be equal to y. That's true, if x equals y, for example, if x equals one and y equals one, then x squared and it equals y squared. Same thing holds true if x squared is equal to y squared is sufficient that x be equal to y if we chose any other value like zero, that's also a real number. Now a lot of people choose b, but it's the wrong answer. A necessary condition for x to be equal to y is that x squared be equal to y squared. That's actually true. It is a necessary condition for x to be equal to y that when we square them, they equal each other. Now the answer e here says if x squared is equal to y squared, then x is equal to y. You cannot infer that because if x squared were equal to y squared, that tells us that either x is equal to y or x is equal to negative y. So either of these cases are true given this information. So we can't infer that x is equal to y, making e the correct answer choice.